conducted Ray originally lasted 34 minutes. I intentionally kept quiet a lot to let him make some conversation, but it seems like he's not capable. I cut out 13 minutes of awkward silences and pauses. Dr. Dre is quite arrogant and doesn't want to work too hard. He's easily insulted because after this call, he blocked me and didn't ever come back to me again. Hello? Hello? Oh, I can hear you now. Did you change your settings? No, I had to update the app, turn off the phone and turn it back on. Okay. How are you? I am doing good, and you? Me too. It's been a long time. Say what? I say it's been a long time. It has. You have been a very busy woman. And you barely chat. Yeah. Why? No, I said you've been a very busy woman. Yeah, and I said, and you'd barely chat with me. I do, but sometimes it takes you a while to respond. Yeah, but even when I respond, you barely answer. Uh, well, I try to. I'm here now. Yeah, because I called you. Well, I apologize if I haven't been responding. I, I, I usually think I try to respond because usually I'm the one begging to talk to you. Mm, not really lately. I feel a bit ne neglected. That's not true. Come on. No, it is true. Are you talking to other women? Are you confusing them with some, me with someone else? I'm not confusing you with anybody. It's not hard to reach you. It was. It's only been recently, though, so that you've been comfortable, you know, with, you know, a phone conversation, technically. It's been two months ago that I, that I called you last time, and we barely chatted ever since. Like I said, because you've been busy. And because you didn't respond. I do respond, but you were sending me something with a thumbs up or with a wave or... Yeah, of course, because if you don't make an effort, why should I? Well, if there's anybody that has been making effort, I think I have been making a lot of effort. Okay, so you, do you want to argue about this or do you just want to apologize for your behavior and tell me that I'm right? Apologize for what? For neglecting me. I have not been neglecting you, that's what I'm saying. Okay. Well, then I guess you're not the man for me because I don't like the way you, you treated me. I don't know what you mean. I didn't treat you any out. You send me a message, I respond. You respond I very, very short. You barely say anything. So yeah, that's not okay, really making I, an effort. Okay. I apologize for, you know, oh, I apologize if you feel that way. Apologies. No, 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 no. no you can't apologize because I feel something. You can apologize for something that, that you did. I don't know what you want me to say. You say apologize, I apologize. Now you're spinning it out of this say that. What do you want me to do? You can't you can't apologize for my feelings. Okay, now I'm still confused. I don't get it. Do you want to have a relationship with me or not? What is it that you want? I don't I really don't understand. Well, I do want a relationship, but it's hard to do that when you barely respond when I text you. That's what I'm saying. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. You're saying that you barely respond when I text you. We're both saying the no. same thing. No, I'm saying that you barely respond when I text you. You're a man. You should make some effort. Well, don't put it like that. I'm a man. Like, you're making it sound like I don't. I've been the one literally begging you for phone calls. Remember? I literally beg you for that. That's years ago. Okay. Let, it, let it go. I've been, I've been begging for that. Let you it know? go. No, it's not a matter of letting go. I'm a human being, too. So if I... I'm a man, yes. If I put an effort towards a woman that I like and she's not reciprocating it, at some point you start feeling like she doesn't want it and you're being a bug. Nobody wants to be a bug. I give short That's answers when I don't get anything from a man. If you don't make you an effort, you will if you don't make efforts to show me that you like me and that you appreciate me as a woman, then you will only get short answers from me. So you really you really have to step it up, mister. Okay. Okie dokie. Well, I'm waiting. Waiting for what? For you to step it up and make an effort. Well, we're talking. Oh, really? And we talking? We talking. Okay, talk. Yeah. I'm listening. So, what's been going on with you? What have you been up to? Anything new, out of the ordinary, family? Well, I've been working on some uh, on some big uh, contracts, making a lot oh. of money recently. So that's that's nice. I'm going to the United States soon to visit my friend and uh, go to her Halloween party. Oh, look at you. Little Miss Sunshine. Okay, that's good. What about you? 
Uh, I'm helping out with the crisis here. A lot of sick people, people that need medical attention, people that need medical help, wounded, injured. You know, just doing the best I can. So what happened recently? Recently? Yeah. Um, like in, last, in the, the last two, three days. Uh, we've been dealing with victims with the, from the whole pager incident, Lebanon, where phones were going off. Having to deal with that, having to deal with that. A lot of... Um, a lot of injured patients, a lot of people sick in asylum in various places, a lot of people that need to be vaccinated. That's a lot. Vaccinated for what? Flu shots. A lot of people get a flu oh. shots. Oh, so the bombs, they, they, they spread the flu as well now. No, any, any like, let's say they're moving, they're seeking asylum from Lebanon to, like, say, Egypt. They have to be, you know, vaccinated just in case. You don't want anybody carrying anything. Like any diseases or whatnot, it's 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 you know standard government official procedure. You know, you're just wanting to make sure nobody's bringing any anything into you know. That's what I mean. Okay. Yes, ma'am. So what else? Hmm. What else? It's pretty much been it. Just been working. Didn't have a day off. Um, it's usually Sundays, and when I get my days off, I use it to you know rest, sleep, recharge. That's about it. And what about the nice Muslim nurses? What about the what? The nice Muslim nurses. You told I mean, me about them can... the other day. Hello? That's what I'm saying. Well, what I are you saying? You. you didn't say anything about it. You have, you let when you ask me a question, at least give me a time to talk, okay? I just feel like I'm being interrogated instead of being asked <laughs> a question. First, <laughs> I'm giving you plenty of time to talk, but you give me these long pauses like you don't know what you've been up to. Like you have to make up something on the spot. Are you hiding something? I'm not giving you any pause or whatnot. You act, you ask me a question in two seconds. You're like, well, I have to answer. <laughs> not two seconds. Come on. It's what you're doing. Mm -mm. Nurses are good. They're fine. Some days they're good. Some days they're not so good. You know, I mean, every day, sometimes they're not happy with the schedule. Sometimes they're not happy with the hours they're working. But we find a way to make it work. Pretty much just taking it one day at a time. That's all. So what do they Is do when, uh, when they're not happy? What do they what? What do they do when they're not happy? They throw tantrums, they complain, you know, then I have to tell them the schedule is the schedule. They have to, you know, get with aren't, the program. Aren't you ever getting tired? I mean, I do. I'm a human being, but it's the job. What are you going to do? I don't know. Go home, I guess. I do get to. I do get to. If I do say so myself. I do get to. You're not really making sense. What do you mean? You asked, what can I do? And I said, you can go home. And what's your response to that? A bit of nonsensical babbling. Okay, number one, it's not nonsensical babbling. And number two, stop being rude. It doesn't suit you, okay? I get You asked me a question. I give you an answer. I am not Sometimes. rude. Don't call me rude. Come on. You can be, okay? I can, I can, be, me... I can be if I want to. And I'm a woman. That's I can behave however I want to. No, that, that that that's that's I don't know where you get that attitude, but it's it's very wrong. If you ask someone a question, ask someone a question because you want to get that other person, not like an interrogation. I'm not saying you can't be how you want to because you're a woman. Who taught you that? God did. He says I'm good the way I am, and well, you said you like me. He didn't create you to be rude and disrespectful. No offense, but I'm not, not. I'm not disrespectful. Well, the way you talk, you can be. Hey, come on, we're not discussing my behavior here. Oh, why not? Because we're not. Oh, that's what I'm saying. I'm, I'm I was you asking about. I was asking about your job. And I told you about it. And you you spin it around and you're going to talk about my about about my attitude. What's that about? Come on. Be no, serious. No, 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 if you had it, call it out that it's rude because it is. You know what would be rude if I would curse you at you? Do I curse at you? No. If you what? If I curse at you, that would be rude. I mean, if you want to, you're the one that has your mouth. Okay, so I can call you a motherfucker. You have your mouth. You say what you want to say. Okay. Okay, then don't complain that I'm rude. No, you are. The way you talk, you can be. Yeah, I can. I don't need your permission. I... Thank you. My point exactly. Good. Then, then don't complain about it. If it's wrong, I will complain about it. And I will not listen to it. So when are you going home? When you say home, you mean home stateside or home where I sleep after work? No, stateside, of course. Hopefully in a couple of months. How long have you been gone? I've been in Gaza since the whole thing started, what, six, seven months now? Really? But before that, you weren't home. You were on another assignment. 
I was helping out in Somalia and Somalia isn't too far from here. So when they started, they needed doctors over here. So boom. Mm -hmm. So how long have you been gone from home? That's what I asked. Going on two years now. Is that even legal? It is. It is. Look, this is what I mean. You're letting me do all the talking. You, you, let, me ask, me you, let, me, you let me ask questions, but you don't really tell me a lot. And when I don't ask questions, you just don't say anything. <laughs> That's well, what I'm was, talking you about. You're not making an effort. You asked me a question and I answered. You asked me a question and I answered. What else do you want me to say? You asked me a question and I answered. Oh, okay, I guess you don't really like me that much then. It's okay. I understand. Have you drunk any wine of late? Um, yeah, yesterday, when I was at a Japanese restaurant. Oh, nice. White or red? White. Oh, okay. White I told you good. last time we spoke that I don't like red wine. Well, you never know. Things change. Oh, have you had dinner? I don't know what the time is there. Yeah, I did. Oh, nice. What did you have? Well, I actually ordered in today. Chinese food. I wasn't in the mood to cook. Oh, Chinese? Oh, that's good. That's good. Not much of a fan of Chinese, but hey. To each their own. To each their own. If it makes you happy, it makes you happy. Is that your favorite Chinese? No, my favorite is pizza. Ah, pepperoni? No. What that? Pizza with cheese. Just simple. Okay. I can't wait for Halloween to find out if it's trick or treat. Is that what you always do when you don't know what to say? You're going to sing a song? I mean, you're a good singer, but. It's a bit weird. No, it's not. It's what I do every time. Whether I know what to say or not, it's just, it's like a it's like I'm a walking karaoke machine. Mm -mm. It's what I do. It's what I do. That's the way. That's how it's supposed to be. Well, besides the vacation you're planning on going to in the states, have you gone on any of late? Yeah, I've been to the Bahamas recently, also with my best friend. Say what? I've been to the Bahamas with my best friend recently on a cruise, with her family. Okay. Did you have a good time? Absolutely. Oh, wonderful. Very interesting. So have you been on any vacations? No. <laughs> I wish. I mean, it's a job. You do have some time off now and then. Not really, no. Like, if I wanted to get out now, I'm eligible. You would have to, have, you know, have to, have, would have to put in word for a contract termination. If I get approved, then we'd have to, you know. Terminated and whatnot. It's well, and do that if you want. A, if you want a vacation, you can do that. Why not? That's what I'm saying. If I wanted one, I would have to terminate my contract here to leave. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So why not? You're a doctor. You can get a job anywhere. That is true. It's quite expensive to terminate it. That's the point I'm trying to make. Mm, usually not. Usually it's the other way around. When you terminate a contract, you just don't get paid anymore. Okay, boss. So where are you going on a, on your vacation? I'm not going anywhere. Okay. Just right here. Just right here. Haven't gone nowhere on vacation. Just been right here. Okay. Just been right here. Oh boy. That's how it is. What else do you have planned for the rest of your day? Well, it's 8.30 here, so I don't have much planned anymore. Watch a movie. What? Well, I'm talking to you now. Depending on how entertaining you are, it will be long or either short. And oh, if it will be short, I'll watch some TV. Okay, what program? Well, I don't know yet. Maybe I'll watch the news. It's more interesting than talking to you this way. There's no Dutch soap, soap operas going on? Dutch soap operas are bad. I don't like them. You don't like them? No. They're that bad, huh? Mm-hmm. Maybe you can become an actress and show them how it's done. <laughs> Me, an actress? No, thank you. I already have a job, a very good paying one. Well, well, you never know. You might just go get a get get a role, and you know, boom. Next thing you know, you're the face of Dutch entertainment. Who says I want to? I mean, life is crazy. Things happen. Who says I want to? Oh, you don't want to. Oh, okay. I didn't say life is is crazy or life isn't crazy. I just said I don't want to. Okay, my bad. So, what do you want to be when you grow up? What are you What are you talking about? Hey. Don't curse. I, I I said Jesus. I didn't curse. Jesus ain't cursing. You're losing using the, the name of the Lord in vain. No, I am not. I oh, you did. Oh, you did. 
I just called his name. I ain't using his name in vain. If you use the name of Allah or Muhammad that way in front of a Muslim, you lose your head. Uh, no, I think I'm very good with my feet. I run so fast they cannot catch me. Trust me. <laughs> You're right. I do. I want to see that. I, I do know how to run. That's for sure. That's the way. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. That is it. Do you have any future plans? Like what? With your friends. I mean, yeah. besides you track. I just told you I'm going to the USA to my uh, friend's annual Halloween party. Oh, okay. I always I meant besides you traveling to the U.S., but okay. Well, I have work to do. I have a lot of uh, events to plan and uh, and attend. Yeah, we're getting towards the end of the year, so I'm sure a lot of people would, you know, birthdays, weddings. I already told you I don't do birthdays. That's tacky. But you do weddings. I do weddings and related events. So bridal showers, uh, bachelorette parties, things like that. Okay, okay, okay. That's nice. You bring a lot of joy to people's faces. Wonderful. Well, I help them a bit. I know. And they give me a lot of money for it, so I'm happy as well. Well, lucky you. Good for you. Good for you. That brings me to the Bahamas and to the U.S. And to all Say the bye. other places. That brings me to the Bahamas and the U.S. and all the other places I want to visit. Yeah. Have you ever been to Greece? Yeah, I have. Santorini, Mykonos, where? Oh gosh, what was the place called again? It was somewhere close to Athens. I don't know. Oh, it's remember. close. To that. I don't. I don't. I really don't remember the name of the city where we were. They all have these 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 weird names that I can't remember. Well, if you if you want to, wait, I don't know. Very, uh... Your line is breaking. I don't hear you. No, I said you want to have a good time in Greece, Santorini. Your line is yeah. breaking. I can't hear you. No, I said if you want to have a good time in Greece, usually Santorini and Mykonos, that's the place to be. Oh, okay. That's not where I've been. Okay. In case you go again, you should try it out. Okay. Maybe I will. Pretty much. And that's the way the cookie crumbles. How? How does the cookie that's, crumble? Oh, it's just it's just a sign. It's like saying that's how the way that's how the way things go, or that's how the way the world goes, or that's how the way X, Y, Z. All right. Another piece of nonsensical babbling. I get it. You have no sense of humor, do you? I just have no patience for time wasters. Uh, the buses don't go where you live, do they? Sorry? Nothing. Okay. Can you blow my so, so what are you doing now? What am I, what? What are you doing now? Online paperwork, inventory that I didn't finish from the week before. So just going through them. Okay, so that's why what? you're so boring in conversation, because you're working. Say what? That's why you're so boring in conversation, because you're working. And no, you are actually the one that has no sense of humor. Oh, thank you. That's why. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. You are welcome. You are welcome. You are welcome. Very much welcome. Again? I've heard this one before. You've heard what before? This song from you. It's not a song. I just said you are welcome. It's a song from Moana, and I told you already it's for kids. I don't think there's a song from Moana that says you are welcome. Which one? I don't you think I know me it. About it. You told me about it last time. Moana? Well, I like Moana, though. I don't. I kids. know you don't. And you don't like ice cream, and you don't like swings, and you don't like birthday cakes, and <laughs> a bunch. I do like them. You just don't give them to me. I, I don't give you what? You don't give me ice cream or flowers or cake. You don't take me on a date. You don't make an effort to show me that you like me. Last time you even forgot what I look like. Uh, number one, I'm in a third world country that is being devastated by war at the moment, so... So you can't be romantic because you are not at home. Because I'm here and you're there. Oh, but you can be romantic if you want to, but you don't really try. Okay, if you say so. I say so. And you know it. If you say so, okay. So what are you going to do now once we get off the phone? I think I'm going to have a wank. You're going to have a what? Never mind. Okay. Guys are usually the ones that do that, but okay. Oh, you, so you did hear me. No, I just wanted to be sure. <laughs> That's what I heard. You have no sense of humor, mister. I do. Perfectly fine. Oh, really? I didn't hear you laugh. No, I said do perfectly fine. You got to do what you got to do. You got to do what you got to do. It makes life easy for you. Go ahead. Have fun. What makes life easy for me? No, I, I, if what you said you were going to do makes life easy for you, then sure, why not? What is going to make life easy for me? You being a wanker. 
Now that's rude. I don't call you a wanker. Why do you call me one? I didn't call you a wanker. You said you were going to wank off. So that's why I said you'd be a wanker. I was going, I was making a joke. I told you. Well, your voice doesn't sound like it's a joke. You sound very serious. I sound very bored. Watch a movie. Oh, so you don't want to talk to me? No, you said you sounded very bored. And then I said, watch a movie. Yeah, I said, I'm bored. bored. I'm bored because you're not entertaining at all. Okay. How would you like to be entertained? Well, I don't know. Play a scene from Moana. I don't remember a scene from Moana. It's been a long oh time. Oh my ago. gosh, that's disgusting. What? Burping in my ear. For fuck's sake. What's wrong with you? Ouch. My bad. Treasures, treasures, treasures. The ABCs of them all. You need to chill, seriously. You really do need to chill. You really do need to chill. What's the weather like in the Netherlands? Hot, chill. No, it's cold. Oh, that's good. And a lot of rain. Cold. Rain out bad too. It means the crops will grow. Not in autumn. You what? In autumn, the crops won't grow. Well, as long as the rain falls, you know, it gives it a chance. You're babbling nonsense again. Seriously. Come on. Crops don't grow in autumn. I was just making a comment about the rain. Jesus, what's with you? What's with me is that I'm talking to a complete idiot. Okay, now that's it. Thank you for watching my video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up. If you want to support me, please click the subscribe button. You can also support me by buying me a coffee using the QR code you see on the screen or through the link in the description of this video. For exclusive perks, you can become a member of my channel by clicking on the join button. If you want to read everything about the adventures with the scammers, go to scambaitingforum.com. Sign up. It's free. I hope to see you there.